I'm Preet Ketarita Nikema. I'm from Burkina Faso. And I'm working as a lecturer and researcher at the uh, University Norbert Zongo, so in Burkina Faso, at the Economic and Management Department. I have a PhD in Applied Economics uh, from University Sheikh Antadop in Senegal. I also hold a master's degree in Human Resource Economics with University Wagatu in Burkina Faso. And my research interests are broadly education, nutrition, gender, and development. I'm also interested by impact evaluation. We, we learn here is like a, you have a, a direct access to World Bank resources and to deepen capacity building. And uh, what I, I appreciate is uh, I, I get the opportunity to improve my research paper because I I was involved with uh, some researcher who helped me a lot with some methodology. Yes, so it was also good. And also I network with uh, other scholars. And this is a enriching experience because you learn from them and also they learn from you. Essentially, we construct an empowerment index, but building is essentially based on a literature, previous literature. So we construct an index for Burkina Faso, and we test if this index is, how to say, really associated positively or negatively to children nutrition. Better is the main is, uh, activity for women in, particularly in Burkina Faso. So, and women are also involved in this, and they are the main producer of food. So, and having them uh, empowered in this sector is a very important tool. First one is about education. If we could, uh, add, uh, for girls and also for women, like uh, for literacy program, if we could, uh, how to say, add like. Uh, nutrition and also agriculture uh, teaching in course syllabus for girls and also for women uh, about uh, sometimes the literacy program. And also what we, we, we suggest to policy is to, to revise the uh, development plan in terms of agriculture policy. They could, uh, uh, how to say, about land because we learned the, the land is the, the main input in agriculture and women particularly have no access and even if their access is limited, so if a policy could uh, improve this access to help women to be more involved in agriculture. Firstly, the World Bank is a good place. So I, the first thing I, I will do is like when returning in Burkina is to go to the country office and uh, to present this research. So I think because World Bank is collaborating with uh, government, so it's a good way to be here that, uh, by this government. And also I could use ARC think tank network uh, to disseminate also, uh, both inviting ministers, also uh, the other uh, institutes in the country, because they are working uh, closely with government and also policy makers, so they could, have to say, help me raise my voice <laughs> to be here. And what I advise for also uh, uh, older women is to, to do to do like me because we, they have to be involved in network because the important thing is to network. You can't uh, work alone, do research alone is not possible. You have to network because in uh, networking you can uh, uh, get experience from uh, women who are maybe in a higher level than you, so you can learn from them and how you also can do to improve yourself. So and. Um, but uh, uh, the fact is, in economics, we are few women <laughs> represented. So maybe it's why uh, the, our voice is not raised raise up. Uh, maybe in social media, we didn't find uh, many women uh, showing the research results. And sometimes it's like a social norm. Uh, women could be involved in social media, but not uh, showing the, res uh, the, the research results, just to like uh, social media to uh, like uh, family things or 
like social, but not showing the uh, the research result. But I I think if women are implement uh, are involved uh, in you know, I have to say network, they could have a uh, maybe they became more strong because when you are alone, not possible. But when you are in a network, you could be strong and also use this as a voice to be heard by by other by men and also by government. So it's what I could advise other women. So to be involved in network is the the main way to be heard by by government. Thanks.